Hi family, welcome back into the channel. This is Nikki, good to be here with you. Guess what family, you are blessed and you are being protected. God is getting ready to reveal to you why you had to relocate in a different place. You're not going to believe this family when God opened up your eyes and when he gives you that extra insight in the realm of the spirit, you were being sought after. And sometimes, family, it wasn't for a good reason. This is why God has rerouted you. This is why God causes you to go the long way around. But guess what? No weapon formed against you will prosper. Not one weapon. And every tongue that rises against you is already condemned. You are blessed. You're highly favored of the Lord. God is dispatching angels to bless you. So be careful how you entertain people today, family. Be careful how you're entertaining strangers. I am telling you, family, because literally you're going to be entertaining an angel and you're not going to be aware that you're entertaining an angel. Your blessing is almost to your doorstep. The blessing is almost in your hand. The closer you get to the blessing, the closer you get to your breakthrough, the closer that you get to the place that you have been praying for, that you've been laboring for, you're going to get hit real hard. You're going to get hit real hard because the enemy wants to send you a distraction to back you up. But don't back up. Don't slow up. Don't slow down, family. Don't turn around. Don't do a U-turn. Whatever you do, don't do a U-turn. Now, guess what? You're going to have people to try to come back, family, to stop you. Who are these people? It is always going to be the past before God blesses you. God will always allow us to go through, family, something that has to do with your past. Why does God do all of us like this? Because he has to make sure, family, that you're done. That you're done, 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 done. You know, you're done with a lot of things in life. You're done with a lot of people. But sometimes, family, people just not done with you. Because you got away. They didn't want you to get away. And now people have made it their job to try to cause you to slip, to fall, to back up and to turn around. But don't you turn around and don't you back up. Because God has amazing blessings for your family. You all are so blessed and you're protected. God is going to reveal to you some of the things that he's protected you from. Sometimes God will have you to go the long way around in life and you don't know why you're going this way because you're being protected. You've been protected from somebody and you've been protected from something. And God is going to reveal to you why. A lot of you have a lot of questions as to why. God, why me? Why me, God? And sometimes, you know, people may think that you don't ask God why. It is perfectly okay to ask God why. You're not insulting God's intelligence. You're not insulting him as being our God. You're not. It's a question. It's an honest question that we all have asked. I have asked God, why? Why God? Why me? Why not you? And let me tell you why. Because you are anointed. Why don't you type that? Because I am anointed. This is why, family. This is why you're going to go through the most. This is why you're going to get the, the worst backlash you can get. This is why you're going to go through the worst portrayals. This is why. Because you are anointed. You are the anointed. And God chose you to do something absolutely amazing. And you ought to be glad about that. But you can get ready to get your blessing. Are you ready to get your blessing? Are you in position to get your blessing? Are you ready to get your breakthrough? Are you ready to get your miracle? I want you to affirm that I'm ready to get my breakthrough. I'm ready to get my miracle. I'm ready to get my blessing. God has a blessing with your name on it. Whatever your name is, whoever's listening to this today, why don't you type your name in the comment and say, God has a blessing with my name on it. What God has for you, it is for you. No enemy can stop the blessing that God has for you. We are the only people that can stop, hinder, frustrate, and prevent the blessing from coming to us. God is going to show you, family, that he's protected you from things that you didn't even know were trying to get to you to destroy you. This is why it's good to pray. Always pray. Always pray, family. To those of you who feel like you don't want to pray another prayer. I want to encourage you to pray. I want to encourage you not to quit praying. I want to encourage you to hold on so you can see what your change is going to be. 
Hold on because your change is coming. This is what God wanted me to tell you today. Those of you who are listening in, hold on because your change is coming. Your change is coming and it's right at your doorstep. Your change is right before you. All the things that you're going through with is bringing in your change. It is ushering in your change. It is ushering in your blessing. It is ushering in your marital kingdom person, that kingdom person that you've been believing God for, all these things that you have gone through with, it is causing that person to find you, family. He that findeth a wife findeth a good thing. You don't have to look for it. So if you're looking for it, don't look for it. God said that person is going to find you. He's going to find you. She's going to find you working. You're going to be working. You're going to be doing things. And God's going to cause a blessing to fall right in your lap. This next blessing is going to fall right into your lap, family of God. We want you to pray daily. We want you to seek a relationship with God. That intimate relationship with God is all we need, family of God. It's all we need. It is more than enough because without prayer, we're nothing. Without that personal and that intimate relationship with God, we can't do anything. You're going to do everything that you set out to do, every single thing. God has blessed you to be a blessing. He's going to empower you to prosper. He's going to empower you to get things done that you needed to get done. And he's going to allow the enemy to fail every single time. The enemy is going to always fall flat on their face. So let the enemy run behind your family. Their end will be like Nebuchadnezzar. Your enemy's end is going to be like Pharaoh family. God has prepared a, a place for you. And God has prepared a path for you. God has made that path straight. So walk in your path. Walk in your blessing. You got some good news that's coming to you. To those of you who are listening, you have good news coming to you. Expect good news that's going to come to you in the coming days. Expect the breakthrough to come to you in the coming days. It's a pleasure to be in your homes, family. I thank God for all of you. Thank you for what you do daily on our channel. Thank you for your prayers, all of your acts of kindness. Thank you for supporting that book, Becoming a Master of Divine Consciousness. Keep hitting that like button, family, because it helps the algorithm of our channel. We want you not to get scammed here. So when you see that scammer reply, delete the reply. Don't engage with it. Don't let it get in your spirit. And then I want you to continue to report these people. You did everything that you were supposed to do. Everything that God inquired of you to do. Everything that God required of you to do. You've done that. So now sit in a place of power. Sit in your place of authority, family. Because God is going to bring your blessing right to you, family. The blessings of the Lord are going to run you down. It's going to overtake you. Why don't y'all affirm that today? Why don't you affirm that? That the blessings of the Lord is going to run me down. It's going to overtake me. It is. God is going to restore you. What is he going to restore? He's going to restore the years, the years, not just the days, the months, the weeks. God said, I'm going to restore the years. Everything that the canker worm, the palmer worm, and the locust has eaten. God said, I'm going to restore that. You are blessed. You're highly favored. And God is going to cause that blessing to knock right at your doorstep. So get in position and you stay in position, family of God. I'm excited for you and I'm excited for your future. Thank you for all your emails that you all have coming in, all your prayer requests and your praise reports. It is a blessing and an honor to pray for you. And I'm so happy and elated to hear your testimonials coming in. And you know what warms my heart even more, family? The prayers you all send this way. And how you encourage one another in the comment section. Whatever you do, don't engage in negativity. You let people be people. Let people be people. You keep focused because you're going somewhere. Your faith that you have, your faith is taking you somewhere. Your faith is taking you somewhere great. This is Nikki and it's great to be in your home. I love you. We're going to talk later. Bye-bye.